Hi, this is Mohammed Tohami. My friend Joel Zaslavsky from Value of Simple sent me a very interesting question. Um, he asked, what does simple living mean to you? Uh, and in this video I would like to answer that question because for me, simple living means uh, the same as in the quote of Hans Hoffman, which is the ability to simplify means to uh, eliminate the unnecessary so that the necessary may speak. Since 2003 I'm helping people all around the world to find their passion and live it and make money from their passions. And for years uh, I didn't know about simplicity and that's why passionate, the passionate living journey that I was living and that I was telling people to do was distracted by so many things and when I realized the importance of simplicity everything became easy and uh, seamlessly because simple living paved the way to your heart to speak Every, in the simple living sphere everyone is talking about um, eliminating the unnecessary decluttering 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 but they forget or most of them ignore the second part of the equation which is so that the necessary may speak which is the voice of your heart the voice of your passion the voice of the things that matter most to you this should come first so that simple li simple living facilitates the way it removes everything that is unnecessary irrelevant that doesn't mean anything to you so that what is important stays and you become more clear about the things that makes you really happy. So for example, when when we received the news of my new baby born Adam, uh, and we already had Malika, she, she was three and a half years old back then, and she was very active and demanding kid. So we thought that our life is having a, a very tough turn because now we will have to handle the two babies and uh, the shores behind them and the responsibilities behind them and so on. So me and my wife decided to sit down and simplify because simple living is always the answer to find time, energy and money for the things that matter. So now Adam is coming and being in our lives is, is very, very important. He is a, a, a pleasure and treasure having Adam. So to, we, we had to simplify. So we started with the kitchen and we eliminated like 50 to 60 percent of the utensils in the kitchen. And my wife thanked me for it because she now has less time cleaning the kitchen. Uh, cleaning or uh, dishwashing, uh, less time to prepare meals because we now have, we, we had less stuff and we started to adapt simple meals so, so that we don't have to wash a lot of, you know, dishes and so on. So things started to become very simple and this cascaded in other areas of our house and our lives as well. So that when Adam uh, arrived, we now had more time and more space and more energy to take care of him and enjoy this newborn baby. So the same applies for your passion in life, for the things that you would like to do with your life, the things that will make you happy. In the middle of distraction, it's very hard to focus on the things that matter and listen to the voice of your heart. But with simple living, with your plate empty and free, and you have free space and room for your heart to speak, you find a way to take care of things that matter most to you. So this is what simple living means to me. Now it's your turn. Write for, to, write for me and Joel in the comments below what simple living means to you. See you soon. Bye.